Central Bank of Argentina prohibits banks from offering services with cryptocurrencies. The announcement came after an agreement between the Latin American country and the IMF. The IMF is... Well, you all know how I feel about the IMF with my antics and commentary most weeks. Um, I'm not a big fan of the IMF. I think they're predatory. I think they're a disgusting organization that preys on people and imposes some pretty draconian measures to encourage them, encourage them, uh, I would say extort them into doing certain things. And uh, I'm not a big fan. I think it's a little weird. Uh, Argentina is likely being strong-armed into doing things like this. Uh, we'll see where it heads. I don't know. I, I think it's just going to increase the demand for open currencies and politically neutral currencies, which is great. That's, that's very bullish for open economies. Uh, but... There we go. Um, I think there was a follow-up news article about that. I think I might have accidentally moved it. Anyway, we'll take a look. Oh, here we go. So, Buenos Aires uh, is to allow residents to make tax payments with crypto. This is pretty in interesting. Um, I think... If Argentina is prohibiting banks from offering services with cryptocurrencies, but they're also encouraging residents to make tax payments with crypto, um, it's it's interesting, right? You're starting to see contention points with cryptocurrency emerge like this, and uh, it's fascinating to watch. It really is. Hey, Alonso. 